All right. Boston supporters got to stop comparing Pacquiao's wins to Floyd's wins because I see this all the time and it's really annoying. So let me take the time out again to explain this. All right. Pacquiao is not Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather is and always was the A plus fighter. He was the guy. You know, he is from the lineage of a Ray Robinson, Ray Leonard, um, Muhammad Ali. You know, he is what Peyton Manning is to his sport. Peyton Manning was always the guy. He was always supposed to be successful. I mean, he was the first draft pick. He was always on top. That's Floyd Mayweather. He was supposed to do good. Pacquiao is more like Tom Brady. Seven round, seventh round draft pick, supposed to be a nobody, that sort of thing, right? But, you know, I think Pacquiao is a little bit better than, well, he was better coming up than Tom Brady, supposedly, but, um, you know, he still was not supposed to be that good, right? Him him nor Tom Brady. Him and Tom Brady were, were supposed to be, like, losers for the most part, right? They weren't supposed to be successful. But somehow, we got Tom Brady winning three three Super Bowls, and we got Pacquiao knocking out people and being successful. You know, he was not supposed to knock out Hatton. You know, he's not supposed to beat Miguel Cotto. He's not supposed to beat Oscar. He's not supposed to. Catch whether or not, he's not supposed to. That's the difference. That's what I'm trying to explain to people. But I don't understand what's so hard about that. I mean, Floyd said this himself. And I'm going to use his terminology. He says that he is the watermelon. And comparing him to Pacquiao is like comparing the watermelon to, to a grape, right? So as the watermelon, you're supposed to do more. You have the talent to be the first guy to come from 130 and reign as the champion at the 147, 154, and the 160 division. Because you have the ability to, you have the talent to. Pacquiao does not. If he does, that's incredible, but he shouldn't be able to do it. If he does, it's even greater because of where he came from, because of who he is, and because of his talent. I judge the talent. I judge what a guy can do, what he has in him, and everything, right? Floyd has that ability, so I expect you to live up to, to your ability. As the watermelon, you should break everything, right? Pacquiao turned out to be a heavier grape than he was supposed to be. That's the difference. Same thing with Tom Brady. That's the difference. They're successful, but they should not be um, as successful as they are now. So that's the difference. That's why Pacquiao receives more credit for beating the guys that he, that he beat. You know, I, I don't want to hear it no more. I don't want to hear people talking about how come Pacquiao received more credit for doing something that Floyd did. It's because He's not supposed to. That's that's so simple, man. I don't know what's so hard about that. Um, Floyd, as the as the main guy, he's supposed to push the sport forward and do what people don't think he can do. People think that Lord's supposed to. Well, people think that Lord can beat Floyd, so Floyd should go fight Lord. But instead, we t we're talking about American Conor, Victor Ortiz, and Marcus Madonna. That makes no sense to me. I mean, Miguel Cotto. He's finna go fight Sergio Martinez. People are picking against him. I mean, if if Pacquiao fights Timothy Bradley, people are picking against him. Nobody's gonna pick against Floyd Mayweather being the American. So, I mean, that's not a legacy fight. So, you have to do things that are incredible because he has the ability to do and, and to carry the sport into new, um, you know, impossible situations he can do the impossible just let him you know stop trying to hold this guy back we know he's from 130 we know that but he can be the first guy to come from 130 and be that champion let him do it be it and do it let him all right so that's what i say about that that's why pacquiao receives more credit for beating being certain guys because he was not supposed to but anyway man i'm out of here thanks for watching have a great day.